Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new series. Uh, I've been looking forward to this one for a while. I'm a big fan of FTP Infinity, Infinity Evolved, Infinity Evolved Skyblock, especially the latter two. But um, this pack has been out for a little while now and I've been waiting for a little bit because there's obviously almost with every Minecraft pack ever, there's loads of problems and loads of little issues that I can't be bothered to deal with at the start of one pack. So here we are, Feed the Beast Beyond, which is the new 1.10.2 version of uh, FTB Infinity. So it's what you would consider easy mode. And um, we're going to have a playthrough of this, but as you can see in the top corner here, Expert Mode is coming soon, apparently. And um, I'll be definitely going into that, and I'll probably what I'll do is continue with this series a little bit, put it on the back burner, and have it going in the background. But switch over to live streaming the Xbox mode the moment it's released. So yeah, with no further ado. Also I was gonna play this on a server that I know that wow it's run it's middle aged Minecrafters and I'm a bit older than average Minecraft player as you can probably tell. Um Yeah, uh so I mean I've got a swag extension pack this already just to uh Settings and I've got music in the background. And I can play what you can hear, the way people are approaching Nirvana as I've been throughout this entire series. Um, yeah, and that's about all there is to say. So, without further ado, let's go to the So, obviously, we're going to see actually the shapes of my channel. AE2 is in here, along with Paragraph, which is in the return. Uh, Aquaculture's in here, architecture crafts in here. So we've got the dimensional world as well, so we don't have to destroy our overworld with mining, which is nice. It's also a nice place to actually build a base, a secondary base if you want to. A uh, completely flat world. Um, and I think the daytime nighttime cycle has been re-enabled, so there is nighttime in that world now. I'm not sure, don't quote me on that, we'll find out as we go along. So better build of ones is in Biblia craft, so we can make pretty but we get to actually build a nice house a bit further down the line. Blood Arsenal, Blood Magic's in, Blood Magic obviously, Matania, love a bit of Matania, some good stuff. Um, Scrummage, just try to build Chisel, Chisel and Bits is in so we can make things even more pretty when we get the chance to. Uh, obviously that's not going to be my aim to start my aim and start is going to be to get a decent amount of power, a decent amount of resources and some basic machines. Compact solo erases in, which is kind of handy. Uh, the, the, the Dark Utilities has some nice little objects today. Decocraft is back again. I think the Decocraft allows some bases later that time. I'm not the world's best builder, but I intend in this series to 100% definitely try and become the best builder. And there we go. Um, yeah, so we've got Deep Resonance, that's a little power solution. I am going to try and dip into as many of these mods as possible throughout this series. Just to give you, well, my limited knowledge and my answer to some questions you're going to have about uh, Draconic Evolution's in, which is nice, the whole crafted system. If you haven't seen it in 1.10.2 yet, it has changed quite a bit with the way you craft things. And it's a little bit more balanced, not much, it's still pretty OP. But it's a little bit more balanced than what it was before. Drawers and bits is nice. So that's like um, storage drawers and chisel and bits. Do a bit of work together. It's good. We've got an elevator mod in here. Now, one thing that is missing from uh, 1.10.2 Minecraft is uh, open blocks. It's a shame. I don't think it's going to be, but they, one guy's gone ahead and made the elevators out of there uh, and made his own mod of it. Embers hasn't seen much love. 1.10.2 from what I've seen so far, so I'm gonna try and have a look into that and see how we go. End IO, end core, end storage. 
environmental techs in here too. Um, I might try and give some bits from that go, just like some power generation and stuff. Although by the time I get to extreme reactors, which is also in here, um, probably not going to be here, to be frank. But I'll probably build it anyway, because ET Luna's in here, so that's Luna power at Silver Power. Black kind of blood, bone fix is a nice thing, they're starting to make it more accessible. Lower spec computers, okay, this is my media. I have a full on game in desktop, I have this Swedish one which is set up mainly of media yeah. playing live games like this. I wouldn't try to stream that style. Um, Forestry's in here, that's fine. Uh, Industry, yeah. so we're looking at bees at this, in this pack at some point. Immersive engineering then gives you some basic stuff at the start. How is it going? Industrial craft 2. Still going strong all these years down the line. Industrial yeah. craft 2. And you know, it's worth play at some point. Um, yeah. Iron chest, GI, blah blah blah. Long 4 boots are in, which is nice because the long 4 boots. But, Mob grinder util, so it's got a mob grinder mod button to it. I've seen it before, no I'd rather just go down the draconic route because the draconic mob grinder is just nice. Um Let's see. Now this is a new thing that's come back and um, I've not seen it for a long time. Modular force field system. Not seen in so long and it was awesome. Along with ICBM when you had nuclear missiles, but that was just craziness. Basically, and one of the force field systems is your way around. But yeah, it's it's back and it's in, and we're going to see how it's working out. So, this, by the way, is version 1.2.1, which is the most recent one. So, we're going to see how that goes. Um, it's delicious. Wow. Sure. Yeah. Pam's Harvest Craft is in. Pam's Harvest Craft is in. It's really good power. It. It's yeah. just awesome. Project Red is back in here. Um, add some nice little pieces to get to that size in here. I do want to get a bit more inside. So I've not really used it that much. I've played with the basics and stuff. But yeah. yeah. Quantum Storage comes in handy for holding your cobblestone and your dirt and stuff like that. Quantum storage tanks just hold, yeah. the tanks hold ridiculous amounts of liquid and the uh, storage cores just hold ridiculous amounts of liquid. But it's good if you yeah. want to keep a large amount of uh, like your yeah. basics, cobblestone, and uh, sand, and all that kind of stuff. So, yep, yeah, railcraft, nice, and there are quarks in here, still. Range pumps is useful, it's exactly what it says on the tin. Uh, refined storage is here, uh, alongside A2, and I'm Planning to probably use both at some point. Um, have two separate systems running. So we'll see how that works out. I'll try to find ways to sort of combine the two. Uh, RF Tools is in here, and in the latest version of uh, FTB Beyond, RF Tools Dimensions has been added. So we can have some extra dimensional adventures. Roots, then simple void world. Okay. Simply Jetpacks 2 is in here, so that's enough options for early game flight. Uh, Slant's in, that's useful for growing the sand stuff. Super Circuit Maker's in. Um, we able to set up our own logic gates um, in a one block space, which is nice, and we'll see more about that as we go on. Tech Reborn is like IC2, basically. Uh, it has a few extra bits and a few different bits, but it's like a more modern version of IC2. And I've seen a lot of packs add both of these and I was just see and find out what they have to do. And make it a comeback to 1.10.2 for the thermal expansion. Oh, how I missed the thermal expansion. But what you'll see at the moment is it's only thermal expansion with thermal expansion. We haven't got thermal down, so I don't know if I haven't got any cables yet. Yes, but I'm pretty sure we've got power. Uh, Tinker's Construct. 
Wireless redstone, handy. Yabba is a type of burning Jabba. One eight and one nine blue good and it just changed them a bit and it's so long to be able to use the cost of the board. Especially so much uh expansion has just come out. So yeah, I know this first ten minutes is all being yapping on about stuff, but um we're gonna get anywhere. So I'm gonna play our single player world just so that I can update my game on my pace and not have to worry about And I didn't mean to do that, so we're going to have to start that again. I just wanted to add in some options. Who knew? So we're just going to have to generate this world and then delete it. Yay! And what I don't, might do with this video is uh, when I'm offline and stuff like that, I'll probably just shut that down. And I'll try and do my mining and stuff like that. Great wall, I believe. It's basically just starting a void wall up against a wall from the bottom to the top of the uh, bedrock. Cover it in slime. And that's it. It's kind of like a messed up sky bubble. I don't know. I'm not into that. I'd rather avoid one of the sky bubble, but it's not bad. So, yeah, there we go. That's all done. Fine. So now we By the way, if you have a problem with me vaping, um, and it's a problem for you, you probably should leave, because I'll be hitting that all the way through these videos whilst I'm on webcam, so here we go, and we're in our world, and yeah, we got an achievement, get taken inventory, I'm going to move these books out of the way. So, it's Minecraft, this isn't too bad a bio, I might just get some word some food and see how we get on. So, punchy punchy woody woody, as we always do at the start of Minecraft. Ah, oh, joy. Roofed forest. Maybe it's not the best map actually, because these forests that surround in this little plain area here, um, as you can see the map's a bit messed up off to the west and southwest side. Because I have like had a look at this and had a quick check to make sure everything is actually working in the pack. Especially, oops, especially um, the thermal expansion liquids with extreme reactors because we all look a bit crazy. Yeah. Right, Berry bushes. Uh, canola's everywhere. I will need a little bit of that, but it's everywhere so I'll Yeah, I'm not loving this island, so I'm going to go on a bit of a mission here. Some bushes are these, and he's different. Let's make a quick crack. I've got bees. Bees have just got me. Oh my god, what is that? That is an ancient gold. 
Okay, so we found the new mob. And a sword. Right, sweet. Um, okay, so let's.
pretty interested in new limestone. Now I did want to, when I was just testing out this mod pack on the server that I joined, um, want to build my building out of marble, but marble is not that common until you get a some form of automatic mining. Um, it's just no fun looking for it. So I'm kind of thinking I'm going to use chisel stone. Stone. Okay. Well, that seems to be quite a bit of it here. Polished iron is quite a good material, but yeah. What's the use of this Now you might, you guys might think FTB is a bit Yeah, I am gonna use it. Faux show. Sure. Right. So, we'll start with one, two, three, two picks. Shovel, an axe, and a sword. Okay, that's a good start. Right. Oh, yeah, just gonna put down a quick materials chest. Uh, I can stick that on top, can I? Yes. Bang, 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 bang. Um, put stuff over here, and it's night already. Uh. all over again. I need to just watch it. 
Charcoal's done. One more. Ah, we got the new charcoal. Oh, so much. Oh, that's very good. New charcoal? Yeah. Oh, charcoal. And that saves wastage on the coal and charcoal.
coal for days. Well, not really, but it's a start. Diggy diggy. Don't you just love the beginning of Minecraft? It's the same every time. But I literally haven't got about that stone yet. That's what I'm going to do now. Uh, I could put these away for the moment as well. Fill it up useless in the front room. Oh, and the canoe. Okay, three stone. Pressure plate. Juicer. But once these berry bushes get themselves their act together, then we'll see the use of the juice. So much better than just eating the berries. Much more efficient. Right. We have the light. We have the light. I'm just gonna mm -hmm. so it's part of this little bit, so you can see. Iron, because we have the stone pickaxe. I won't be able to get some better ones, which means I can go back and make some iron pickaxe shortly. Well, you know, as I said, I'm not going to show you too much of the fighting stuff because it's not going to be good. But, alright, I'm going to wrap it up here, go down deep into the mine until we get down to level 12, and then I'm going to come back and take it from there in our next steps in our beginnings of FTB Beyond. Thank you all for watching very much. I'll see you all next time for more FTB Beyond. Beyond what? Um, see you next time. Bye!